Welcome back to another Crawl Space Encounters. There we got another one. That was a uh, that was a tough one. All right. This is a very, very large house. Let's check it out. Looks like they had a termite treatment done here at one time. That's never a good sign. There's paw prints. Flash my light over here a little bit. See what we're dealing with. We had a pretty rainy day yesterday. Wouldn't be surprised. Yep. If I see some water. That's a nice sized puddle. right through the wall there. I don't know what they did with the plastic. Looks like they tried to glue it to the wall. It just peeled off. Have a dehumidifier. That's not running right now. I would think that it would have sensed that moisture. I'm trying to dry it up somehow. These dehumidifiers kick on when the when it senses the humidity. filters have to be changed. Look at that. Oh my god. It's black. That should be as white as that. Uh, I'll inform them what's going on. At least we went ahead and got this turned on. So they uh, encapsulated this crawl space, got rid of all the insulation, but they did nothing with water, no drainage system. This, in all reality, is not real good encapsulation. They use a six mil poly. Look at that water. God bless. That's a lot. All this water. I still see footprints everywhere. Look at that. If you folks know what kind of footprints those are, let me know in the comments. Coon, possum, I don't know. Bunch of water, look at this water. Wow. <coughs> water and electricity. Uh, my 
friend. Definitely have some fungus growth here. Well, that was my head. There's just a ton of, a ton of water. Everybody's doing work to their yards outside. We had a lot of rain. Watch this another cross phase. Yes, it is. This is a cross phase over a slab. I don't know how I'm supposed to get in here. Definitely not gonna get in there. Six one two thirty five doesn't help you sometimes in crawl spaces. I've been in some tight ones, but yeah, you would have to call the fire department to get me out of that one. There's a lot of uh, fungal growth. So they added on to this quite a bit. That was an exterior water faucet. Oh yeah. A lot of water. Looks like this house has like chambers. I'm definitely gonna have to get on the other side, but we're gonna have to cut this one short. But you can see, you know, when you do an encapsulation to a crawl space. I know sometimes you don't notice that it needs to drain, but this is just a lot of water. French drain system inside. Put a sump pump. Help out this dehumidifier, because now that thing's gonna run. It's not designed to dry up these puddles. That thing's gonna run, run, run. But you don't want that dehumidifier to burn out. That dehumidifier right there is not cheap. See, that thing's about, it's over, definitely over a grand. But, um, all right, that thing kicked off. Nobody's been maintaining that thing. All right, I'll see you on the other side. Well, in case I don't, don't forget to like and subscribe.